fine. This is normal. Society. I can't. I'm okay being alone, aren't I? Not at this expense. Maybe at this expense. Once our time is up, once the clock stops and time stands still, will we be noticed for being grounded? Like we once were? Or will it be because we were impulsive and left our loved ones to pick up the pieces? What will my mind tell me then? I'm sure they will know. Or will we set ourselves apart by controlling this life in front of us? We are capable. Takes, takes courage. courage. We have it. We, we have, have more than the normal mind can imagine. All of us do. Why can he not focus? focus? Wait. Wait. He can see us. He can see all of us. Open your eyes, Logan. Can't you see it? Who are they? What do they want from me? I can't help them. I'm sure of that. They are you, Gray. Listen to them. Really listen. It's only familiar because it's what you're feeling at this very moment. Don't become so detached. Who needs sanity? I can see them feel their struggle. It's familiar. I can't focus. It's all in my head. This can't be real. You're absolutely right. It is all in your head, but it won't go away. The further you push them away, the fainter they become. But believe me, they will never leave. There are shades of gray where things constantly get lost. Blurred imagery, new sounds, familiar feelings. Keep it together. Keep them focused. I think I can control this mirage in front of me. Are they my puppets? Or am I theirs? Why is this so hard for you to understand? You coincide. Your fate is in their hands. It's actually very simple. There's nothing simple about this. You wouldn't understand. They never leave my mind when I close my eyes. They're there. Open your eyes, Logan. Can't you see it? It's all right in front of you. The only thing I see in front of me is someone who is incapable of grasping a firm hold on their sanity. Who needs sanity? Nothing is black and white. There are shades of gray where things constantly get lost. Where do we go from there? When all else fails, all we can rely on is each other. When I look at you, Rachel, I feel such a sense of loneliness. It's as if the only thing that captures you is the idea that everything could just fall apart in an instant. Whoa, Logan. You really know how to overreact. When you stop and think about who you are, how must it make you feel? From over here, it looks painfully boring. Why not let it all go and live for yourself, live for this moment? That's not the point. Living in the moment cannot possibly erase the past. What's done is done. I can't change that, nor make it into something that has absolutely zero meaning to me. I just think you need to let go. And I just think you need to grab hold. What's so great about having this hold you keep bringing up? Does it bring you peace? Or does it only allow you to bask in your own self-possession? You're one to talk. Look at you. You're an absolute mess. What's wrong with the way I'm dressed? It's unique. Oh, I'm sorry if it doesn't live up to your standards. It's like you can't even concentrate on anything for more than a couple of minutes. Honestly, your moods don't even match up with the situation we're faced with. It's actually quite eerie. Hey, if you're so logical, then please tell me how it's possible we're in this situation you speak of. You think you're so high and mighty, Logan, but the rational advice you try and force on me is only making things worse. 
why me? Why can't they live and thrive in your brain? I don't have the strength or the knowledge to push them in the right direction. This is chaos. What's that? You can communicate with them, Gray. Maybe not out loud, but they can hear you. Just try. Focus. Logan. Rachel lives and thrives in the deepest corners of your mind. You need to face it. To face her. This is all you're doing. It's not scary. It's all very real and inevitable. I'm not the only one with the control. You could have taken over. We're both two very capable human beings. It's funny. You show all the signs of being human. Blood, bones, warmth. But beneath it all, mind and soul, are anything but that. You may as well be an afterthought. Why is this so hard for you to understand? When I move, you move. When I'm in pain, so are you. So why can't you see my side of this? We're in this together. Rachel, if opening ourselves up to the end were up to you, neither of us would be worth his thoughts. I've been the one to make sure that we kept our heads up. I'm the one that made sure we progressed. And I'm at the end of my ropes. This has always been your problem, Logan. You can't let go. You don't want to see the end. But I'll give you the fact that you've done a good job at keeping us at the forefront of his mind. Sometimes things just cannot work out the way we hope they will. If they did, do you honestly think I'd willingly choose this existence? We are stuck. Stuck in constant ups and downs and highs and lows and there's no logic to this! Yes, it's all in my head. This can't be real. Is this what you want to see? Does this make the situation any better? But I know that you were somehow in some way a part of me. But that doesn't mean I have to take full responsibility for you. You coincide. Your fate is in their hands. It's actually very simple. Despite what I feel, you're an adult. And you're on your own. Yes. 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 Oh, wait. No. Being separated won't do any good. This isn't something that can be fought on your own. Rachel, listen to him. Listen to Logan. He's coming to his senses. Look at him. I think they can hear me, Nathan. I think they're beginning to understand. Good, Gray. That's good. Keep their attention. You cannot lose concentration. Look at me. Look at me. No! life. You are my other half. I agree to is that in order to solve this situation we're faced with we need to stick together 
body and mind. Let's just say I've never felt anything like this. So now you understand? Well, this is all very simple, Logan. I can give you life and you can take mine away. You're so left brain, Logan. It's not. It's not up to us to question the series of events that led us here. It's our unity and our way of thinking that will lead us to fight this and make sure it stops. Now the only question for you is, are you in? In order for them to disappear, they need to go together. It's the only way. What if they can't? What if it just wasn't meant to be? Make it meant to be. You have that power. Never forget that. <sighs> Do it for her, Logan. She's worth it. She's worth everything. You may not see it right now, but I promise this will all end up in our favor. Your favor. Come here. Yes. We're that something bigger, right? You still haven't answered my question. Are you in? I'm in. I really hope you're right this time. Does it feel like he's already been here? There's no better time than now. There's no time to think. You need to become one with each other. We're too late. I knew it. Would you stop it and listen to me? What if I'm too late, Nathan? Too late with this all. Maybe Rachel and Logan are a part of me forever. Maybe this is as far as I'm meant to go. I can't force myself to feel whole. So, you're meaning to tell me that if there was even the slightest possibility that you could stay here with me, you wouldn't? But you're not here. You haven't been. Time is slowing down, but time is still on our side. I'm telling you, these are only leading us to the path we're meant to be on. Nothing has happened. We make it happen. Something's not right. Everything feels off. Everything feels off because this is not in your comfort zone. We both agreed we're doing this for the best. We're ultimately saving our life. Saving his life. I can see it. It's all right. can't focus, it's all in my head. Hey, stop and think about who you are. How must it make you feel? 